Enough taking around. Let's talk about the most. <laughs> Hey, this is Amir. This is Diana. And you're watching Vegan Tucson. Welcome back to our channel. If this is your first time here and you're interested in vegan food and other vegan things, the right place. Sit back, relax, grab yourself a cup of coffee and enjoy this episode. We have new episodes every Sunday. Da 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 da! We got a new camera. The old one died, as you know, I've been complaining almost every episode. We got a new one. Hopefully this one doesn't die right after the warranty ended, like the other one. But this time, I got extended warranty. Fool me once, shame on you. Fool me twice, shame on me. Fool me three times, kick your butt. All right, let's get into it. Where are we at today? Today we are at the Templeton. And what is the Templeton? Templeton is a diner. It is on Granville Street in the Entertainment District of Vancouver, BC. Is that what they call it? Yes. There are a lot of other restaurants and retail stores and hotels and entertainment kind of stuff that I don't often go to. So really, I think the Templeton is the main draw for me. Interior, what's interior like? The Templeton is like a 50 style diner. So they have red booths, they have jukeboxes, they have like a diner counter where they have seats as well. You know, at every booth, there's a little mini jukebox that is connected to the main jukebox. And they don't work anymore, but back in the day it did. The other cool thing about it is every booth has its own theme. So one has the Elvis theme, one has like an Hawaii theme, one has like a 50s car theme. We came here on the weekend for brunch. And if you come here on the weekend for brunch, be prepared to line up. It is a very, very popular place for dinner. I don't think it's as busy. I rarely come here for dinner. And what about lunchtime on a weekday? Sometimes you have to wait a little bit, but not as long as we did today. You know, it'd be like a few minutes. But most of the time, you just go and there is something available. To be fair, we could have went in and sat at a bar a bit earlier too, but we didn't want to sit at a bar because we we're filming an episode for you folks. So we, wanted, <laughs> we, wanted a... we had to wait an extra like 20 minutes in line. You better appreciate that. What can they do? I don't know. I doubt it. <laughs> Enough wasting time. Let's talk about the most important thing about this show. Le food. What did you get? This place is not vegan or vegetarian, but they do have clearly marked vegan options. So today I got the VLT with veganaise to make it vegan on sourdough and with a side of fries. And I got this scrambled tofu, the curry one. They got two different kinds, curry and mex. Is it mex? I've never seen, I didn't even know. Yeah, I think there's a mex one, which is, I've tried it. It's good, but I like the curry one way better. The scrambled tofu now comes with vegan bacon. It never did before. You had to order extra if you wanted it. So that was a cool little surprise because it's been a minute since I've been there. And so I like that. I enjoyed that. What other sides did you get to order? I don't think you have a choice. It just comes with fries. Oh, and your sourdough bread. That comes with it as well. That's correct. So which one should we start with? Mine. Let's talk about the VLT. What do you think? I think it's one of my favorite kinds of sandwiches like veggie bacon lettuce tomato so this one was a good version back in the day when we used to come here the sandwich would have like three slices of bread rather than just your regular two slices of bread to make a sandwich so when it had three slices it was really filling now I feel like portion size has gone down so I can easily finish the VLT sandwich. So I like it. Um, I don't remember having three pieces. How yeah. Do you, how do you have three pieces? You have one filling, uh -huh. another piece in the middle, 
filling another piece at the end. Really? Yeah. It was like a VLT Like a triple Big decker Mac? sandwich. VLT Big Mac? No, triple decker. Doesn't Big Mac have? I don't Big know, Mac? baby. Sandwich and burgers are two different things. Like, why are you comparing Big Mac? They're not two different things. A sandwich and a hamburger are the same thing? A burger is a sandwich. What are you talking about? How is burger not a sandwich? Help us out here. Leave us a comment. A burger is not a sandwich. A sandwich is not a burger. A burger is not a sandwich. A sandwich is not a burger. It can't be. I quit. This is the last episode <laughs> of Linking to Some. Been good. See you guys later. Peace. Unsubscribe. No, I'm kidding. I'm kidding. In fact, subscribe if you haven't. <laughs> <laughs> okay, anyways, I enjoyed my sandwich. It also came with fries. You could also have it with soup or salad. I didn't think the soup was vegan today, so I went with fries. The fries were fine. I put some salt on them. They could have used more salt. I didn't put any ketchup. I would have put vinegar if I had some vinegar. I didn't ask for vinegar. I just had it plain today. Real tea is actually one of my to go to uh, Templeton as well. I quite like it. It's nice. It's simple, but it's great that they have a vegan mayo at a non vegan place. Yeah, and vegan bacon. Yeah, absolutely. One, mm. two, three. I'll give it a perfect I five. need more food. Well, like what? You the need more bacon? The sandwich was so little. No, the proportion of the sandwich is good, but the sandwich is so small. Like the piece of bread is really small piece of bread. That's true. That's true. All right, Templeton, write the note down. What do you think of my tofu scramble? I haven't had a tofu scramble at the Templeton in years, years. I didn't even know you could choose different flavors. So when he said curry, I was like, oh, it was really good. I really like tofu scrambles. This one was flavorful, had a lot of different good ingredients in it. I enjoyed it a lot. I would order it myself next time if I go there. It's absolutely one of my favorites as well. It's really tasty. It comes with a nice big portion of potatoes, comes with bread, and as I was saying earlier, it comes with bacon now. So you definitely get a good bang for your buck. One, mm -hmm. two, three. Boom. Anyways, that's what we think. You guys go try it out yourself. And as always, make sure to leave a comment and let us know what you think. I know we've been going to Templeton for over 20 years now, since we were two years old. <laughs> yeah. so not together. No, no, we didn't know each other back no. then. No. Our parents took us there. And would you ever go back? I would absolutely go back to the Templeton. I love diner style places. This place has always had good food, good prices. The service is fast. It's a really great place. Would you say the service is snappy? Yes, I would. <laughs> Good quality, mm -hmm. snappy service? Yes. And would you go back to the Temple Pen? Absolutely. I've been there many, many times and I will definitely go back. It's a good place and I quite enjoy it every time I go back. So, yes, I go back and I recommend you go too and order from the vegan stuff, obviously. If you enjoyed this episode and you like the kind of videos we do, go ahead, take a second, press that subscribe button. Give it a thumbs up. And ring that bell if you won't miss any episodes. It will help us out a lot and it will help you out because you'll be entertained. You will see our faces. Beautiful. Work of art. <laughs> <laughs> Take a look at this video on Amir's face. You'll enjoy it as well. Muchas gracias for watching. <laughs> Thank you for watching.